I'm Natasha Allen. And I'm Sierra Pan. And we're from Mipanyan, a Myanmar-based social enterprise. Our mission is to embolden rural communities to meet their own energy needs. We do this by teaching local technicians to operate and maintain mini grids. Energy infrastructure in Myanmar is in bad shape. The country has one of the lowest electrification rates in the world, and currently only a third of the population has access to reliable electricity. And while in cities that might mean that up to 80% of people can use electricity, in rural areas as little as 10% might be able to do so. But in the face of a lack of public infrastructure, something amazing happened. In over 13,000 villagers, community members took it upon themselves to finance and build energy systems that would meet the needs of their village. With limited to no training, people got to work, hooking up old engines to generators and drawing cables over DIY electricity poles to connect households across the village. This scale of self-help practice, called Kotu Kota Milinye, is unique in the world. This kind of creativity and entrepreneurship is exactly what we want to endorse in Mipanya. That's why we're teaming up with the people who built and operate these systems, the Misea, which by the way means fire master. For over a year now, I've been engaging with the Misea, learning from them, their motivations, the strengths of their systems, but also the challenges and constraints that they face. <laughs> Many of the community energy systems face similar challenges. These systems struggle with reliability, only providing electricity for three to four hours per day, and are also expensive to operate and therefore cost a lot to the villagers, who can pay up to 10% of their income just to keep a couple lights on. And as they run on diesel, they also emit a lot of carbon. But the Misea are constrained in their ability to tackle these issues. And that's where Mipanya comes in. We provide two things to the Misea, access to finance and access to skills and training. With this, they're able to hybridize the diesel system with solar energy to reduce carbon emissions, but also have the operations and maintenance skills in order to provide sustainable, more reliable, and cheaper electricity to their communities. Beyond the village level benefits, our model exemplifies a scalable way to perform reliable system operations and maintenance. Taking the lessons learned from the communities we work with, many of whom have been managing their own mini-grids for decades, we offer customized training and operator support to help them maintain quality of service on the ground. By building on the skills of rural communities, we believe that the energy access sector can ensure that rural households not only get access to electricity, but keep it through sustainable operations and maintenance.